buyer beware. The seven investigators are back tonight checking used cars for sale on dealers lots throughout Metro Detroit. Our Jim Kurtzner uncovered safety recalls they didn't even know about and has an easy way to check before you sign on the dotted line. Follow me undercover through Macomb, Oakland, and Wayne counties. I'm just looking for now. Our target this time, used cars. They look nice and shiny on the lot, but are they safe or do they have a recall? We checked GM, Ford, Chrysler, and foreign models. We checked cars at mom and pop used car dealers and certified pre-owned at new car dealers. The process takes only seconds and is as simple as entering a vehicle identification number on your smartphone. It's also easy for car owners. You can enter your own license plate. Voila, you have an answer. No open recall, so you're good. Oh wow, that's cool. Wait a minute, it came, all this came up? If you're in the market, make sure the one you're looking at does not have an outstanding recall issue. I checked several of yours, mm -hmm. but I put in the VIN number and that's what told me this car had a recall. Okay. It was on this 2013 GMC Terrain. And take a look at the safety recall. It's for a front wiper transmission corrosion failure. It was on the lot of Ford Road Motor Sales in Dearborn. The way we were checking all of these cars is an app from Carfax, and it's free. When I pointed this out to you, what happened with it? What'd you guys do with this? Uh, we called the dealer to verify that the recall was there. They confirmed that it was, and they told us to bring it in. He says they safety check all of the cars they sell. So the fact that I found this one was a fluke? No, it's not a fluke. It's just that um, we don't have the, uh, the technology to check for every recall. So we showed him the Carfax app. If it's covered under a recall, why not get it fixed? New car dealers also sell used cars. Before they go on this lot at Gorno Ford in Woodhaven, they go through a 172-point inspection. It's brought completely to Ford standards. It's certified. That car is basically 100% perfect. While running the info on several cars here, we found this 2016 Ford Fusion that had a recall, a steering wheel attachment bolt replacement. We were told it's not enough to keep the car from being sold. You can still sell a car. And here again, Ford Motor Company makes that call. The dealer doesn't. He urges people shopping for used cars get all the information they can from their own research and ask the dealer for the history they've gotten. They use Carfax data and a second history called Oasis. So any blemishes it would, would flag, show. They flag right there. Nobody wants to get taken for a ride by a used car dealer. This guy didn't want us to show his face. When I buy a vehicle, I feel I'm buying something that would already have these tests done on them. And uh, it appears that they have not been. As we were looking with car owners, we found this 2017 Ford Fusion also had the same recall, that steering wheel bolt. Doesn't mean your steering wheel is going to fall yeah. off. <laughs> this 2010 Cadillac had no recall, but the Carfax app also shows the registration expires in five months. The oil changes past due, the current value of the car and the mileage. And you got 137,000 miles? Yes. Yeah. How the hell? Look, come on, hey man, what kind of app is this? It's called Carfax. And remember, it's an app that can keep you and your car safe, free. Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. We did go back and check, and since seven investigators brought it to the dealer's attention, both used vehicles found with recalls have now been fixed.